Hey everyone, hey dear brothers and sisters in Jesus Christ. YouTube is annoying with their censorship and their deleting of comments because a lot of people think I'm doing that. <clears throat> and while I do delete and block comments and block people sometimes when they're just clearly shilling or trolling, I want to try and help people that have genuine questions so I don't try to delete too many comments. Gary Tennyson says, another BS channel, two of my comments already removed, I was offering more information with regards to this band. And I say, blame YouTube. Are you new to the truth community? YouTube censors and deletes all the time. Please don't get mad with me. Nurse Dream says about my Jonathan Khan video, Khan, Khan, right? Then why do you use his picture and his title to attract people to watch your videos? I don't see any truth you said, only your opinion on people. If I'm making a video about a person wouldn't I have to use their name and their picture in the title so people know what the video is on? What is this person even talking about? And I say to him, just because you don't understand doesn't mean I'm not showing the truth. Research Freemason signs, symbols, and agendas. Sheesh, you don't even know what mudras are. The average person has no idea what a mudra is, and if they want to learn about that, they should research. They should ask better questions than this person saying, why would I use his name and picture? That Because that's what the video is about. Is this person insane? Lionel Richie is a famous singer. Hello, right? He's got some good songs that I liked in the past. It's not really my kind of music, but anyways, he's a famous person. He's also a brother in Freemasonry. I can't stand that the Freemasons use the term brother to call each other things. Christians are brothers and sisters. That's the true sense of the word. Obviously, like when people have a real brother from their family or a real sister from their family, that is something there. But when Freemasons call each other brother, uh, I don't know about that, you guys. So Brother Lionel Richie is a Freemason, an open Freemason. Here he is in a Freemason lodge. There's the square and compass and the G in the middle, the grand architect. He's on an album cover, darkening one of his eyes utterly, doing the Eye of Horus, which is one-eye symbolism, and it's the Eye of Satan. He's doing more one-eye symbolism there. He's successful in the sinful, fallen, biblical world. So he does six, six, six on his hand. And he's got a golden idol to worship, and he's doing the sign of success again. If you think that they're just doing this because everything's A-OK -okay all the time, you are deceived. I do this gesture, what are you talking about? Well, they do it too, but it doesn't mean the same thing. It means something different to them. And it means 666. He's pointing to the camera. This is what's known as the Freemason Grand Pontiff Secret Monitor Point. He's a Freemason, so he's wearing the Freemason checkerboard. They really do these things, signs, symbols, and agendas. He's on an album cover. He's doing the Uttara Bodhi Mudra. It's a funny sounding name. It's a gesture from yoga and Freemasonry. It's supposed to represent supreme enlightenment, but it's the false light of Lucifer. They seek light to move up in degrees, and the light they seek is the false light of Lucifer the light bearer, who is Satan. They're deceived by the father of lies, right? Index fingers together, other fingers interlocked. He's doing it again here. Index fingers together, pressed against his lips, other fingers interlocked. And he's doing it again here, index fingers together, other fingers interlocked. The Uttara Bodhi Mudra, that's how you spell it. It's a real thing. His daughter is Nicole Ritchie. She's darkening one of her eyes utterly, doing one-eye symbolism, which is satanic. And she's hanging out on the Freemason checkerboard. She is married to the pop punk guy, I guess. Like, it's not punk rock to me, but good Charlotte, never into them, don't care for them. I think they're very cheesy. Someone is doing 666 over his eye. Joel Madden of Good Charlotte, who's married to Nicole Ritchie, the daughter of Lionel Ritchie, is doing the vow of silence, just like Lionel Ritchie was doing, right? Oh, wait, did I even show Lionel Ritchie doing the vow of silence? I don't think I did. Let me quickly go and show you the vow of silence that Lionel Ritchie is doing. Whoop, Lionel. Oh, I'm not spelling it properly. There we go. No, I want my pins. So just in case, I didn't show that. I had meant to do that. He's doing the vow of silence as well. Why? Because he's a Freemason keeping the secret, quote-unquote, of the biblical world. Fame, fortune, success, and about Freemasonry, right? They're not going to come out and be like, yeah, we worship Satan. No, they're going to they're gonna have their fame, fortune, and success and keep it a secret. 
and they do other signs and symbols as well, as we very clearly know. So Joel Madden is also doing the vow of silence, just like his father-in-law. And he's throwing up the 666 on his hand. And he posts this on his Instagram, his social media, and he captioned it with God's work. This is not capital G God's work. This is lowercase g in quotes God work. This is the satanic way of doing things. The Freemason square encompassed with the G, the grand architect. He's got the eye of Horus in the middle of his chest illuminated. He's got the eye of Horus in his chest illuminated, and he's got the Freemason square and compass here and some other tattoos. Doesn't look very good, and especially his choice of tattoos, terrible. But can we see how this is all connected, right? Lionel Richie, his daughter, and his, his daughter's husband, right? They're all showing the signs and symbols, and they all push the agendas. They're not going to come to Christ, right? Well, I would hope they would, but it just doesn't seem very likely that they will. They seem like they're so sold out. They love the world. They love themselves. They love fame, fortune, and success. Who cares about eternity? Who cares about hell and going there, right? Brothers and sisters, everyone else, God bless you.